Hey guys, so I did just want to say um, that I am announcing the giveaway winners here. I'm going to insert a screenshot. I did a live last night on my Instagram, so some of you guys saw that you guys won. And some of you guys, um, I either emailed or um, DM'd you. So, yeah, so that's for the winners, for the trackers that I... Uh, for the giveaway for my 100 subscribers and I'm actually at 148 as of right now while I'm recording which is crazy because I feel like I just hit 100 so thank you guys so much for subscribing liking commenting my on my videos um, and if you're not subscribed and you guys you are interested in cash stuffings then go ahead and subscribe I am a server and I work at two restaurant jobs so there's a few things going on this week. Uh, one thing that happened this week, one of my jobs, the newer one that I got, the my boss wasn't paying minimum wage and I randomly just noticed it because I have two paychecks and my other paycheck, I get paid more. And then I looked into it and I realized he wasn't paying us minimum wage. So I brought it to his attention, to his attention and he basically, um, he said that like his accountant just like overlooked it and ADP overlooked it. So I got a paycheck for the um, the amount that I was owed for minimum wage since I started working there, which wasn't much, but that was $59. And then also at my main serving job, which is where I work weekends, that job, sometimes the boss doesn't give us our tips. And this week he gave us all the tips, which basically means I'm going to be screwed for next week because... I won't have the cash from this weekend that I needed for next week. I don't know. It kind of like just jumbled it up and it's going to be tight next week. Also, on Monday night, I went to work and I was there for two and a half hours and I didn't get a single table. And my boss asked me if I wanted to leave. So I said yes because I already wasted two and a half hours there. And then Tuesday night, I called out of work because I needed just a personal day and I called out of work. And then on Wednesday, I don't work. Thursday night, my boss called me out because there was like a crazy storm here and it was raining really bad. And you know, he, he didn't think that there was gonna be uh, any business. So he got, I got called out of work Thursday. And then I went to work Friday. Saturday, my dad came to visit. He lives in North Carolina. And um, my cousins also came to come help me with my house. They live a, a state over like an hour and a half drive. and. Um, they did me the favor to come to like help progress the construction. If you're new here, I bought a house in January. It's a fixer upper and I'm still working on the house. Uh, so they came to help me with some stuff. They um, did some sanding, some spackling and some priming. Um, so they were here for some time. And then my brother came also to help. And my dad came. He came to teach me how to use a lawnmower. He bought me, he ended up buying me the lawnmower as well. I didn't know he was gonna buy it for me. If you watched my video last week, I had mentioned that I was gonna have to start paying more money to Lowe's instead of just for my kitchen cabinets. I was gonna have to pay for my cabinets plus for the um, lawnmower, but my dad ended up buying it for me. So I'm very grateful for my parents. Uh, if you've been watching my channel, um, you'll hear how much they have helped me. With this whole process um so i put all my money out already just because it's kind of like a jumbled up mess but i did want to go over like my little trackers of my tips um so i got my money from whoops i got my money from friday night from april 17th so like last weekend and i got my money from saturday night or sorry from saturday night and sunday night so Saturday night, I made 65, and then Sunday night, I made 33, and that's in cash. And then for that same serving job, my weekend one, I only worked Friday and Sunday this week because I called out, and then Saturday, I called out again to spend time with my dad. So uh, I made 37 plus 16, um, there, and then my paycheck was 448, so that's here. And then I also, this is from my, um, my other serving job, I ended up only working Sunday lunch because I went in Monday, but I got I left early and then Wednesday or sorry, Thursday I got called out. So I made this is how much I made for Sunday lunch. And then this is my paycheck was 324 from my tips from the previous week. And then my 
uh, paycheck for the money that I was owed from like the minimum wage error was $59. So I just wanted to explain to you guys also, since I get my money from my credit card tips the next week, so pretty much I'm owed $21 from this job for next week, which means my paycheck will probably be maybe $30. And then, because I only worked three hours to make that much money. And then this one, I'm owed a little less than like 200. So that means my paycheck will probably be about 200 to 250. And which means that between both of my paychecks, I'm going to be making $300. And I need to make at least close to like $800. So it's going to be tight next week. And I'm going to have to like see what I end up doing. Okay, so for the cash stuffing, um, I do my cash envelopes that go in my wallet first. So for food, it's going to be 65. And then for gas, it's 40. I'm just going to do Actually, I need that. So. And for personal is three dollars. So one, two, three. All right. And then I have my uh, cash envelope binder. So this week is an extra week, so I don't have to fund my sinking funds. Um, because I already have the money I need and that will be my next video is my cash stuffing of my sinking funds So for mortgage it is 415 And I paid this last week So there's nothing in here and I do pay my mortgage bi-weekly And that creates an extra payment every year Household will be getting 15 actually I'm going to put this back and grab a 20 and I'll have 60 and I'm going to be doing this on camera now because and I just wrote the wrong thing um, because I always forget so, all right. Okay, so sinking funds already has is funded for the month, so I should have three hundred. So one hundred twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two hundred twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, three hundred. So I don't have to put any money in here because I do mine based off of four weeks. And then I will skip all of these. And Lowe's, I already paid it for the month. So I'm not going to be putting any money in um, because this is an extra week and I already paid it. Uh, so for dentist, I'm going to be doing 75. put down this 25 and grab 100 so right. and this is for a crown that I need to get done and my insurance or my office needs me to pay it in full before the appointment Alright, so for new tires, it's 60. So, 20, 40, 60.
for Citibank. It's going to be getting the rest, which is three seventy-five. I don't know why I just took this out. All right. And um, so from the last time I stuffed this, my dad actually, when he came to visit, he gave me one hundred and sixty dollars to use for whatever I wanted, and I put it to this uh, credit card. So. So let's just see. This is 100, 200, 300, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here's an extra dollar. Um, so I'm going to put this into personal because it's an extra dollar. And I probably just added it wrong before. All right. So I should have 905. So it's 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, is that right? Yeah. Uh, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 800, 50, 60, so 850, 60, 70, 85, 90, Five nine hundred one two three four five. All right. So I have nine oh five. This credit card right now has a balance of I believe like two thousand. Um, it is a zero percent interest credit card. So if my the guy who's working in my house has this credit card so he's the one that's using it so that that balance is from uh stuff that i have needed for the house whatever materials he needs he can just use my credit card and he gives me all the receipts for taxes um and so i can like check it um but my house is almost done and there's about like two weeks left of work left to do so if my credit card isn't maxed out i don't know if i'm gonna pay it right now because it's a zero percent interest credit card for another like year and a half not a year and a half maybe like 15 months is um zero percent interest so i might just hold on to this because i my mom is also letting me borrow some money to pay another credit card and if i don't have to pay that credit card back right away i'd rather pay my mom back um so i'm gonna accumulate to two thousand dollars so yeah, so that's kind of like my plan for this. Um, it's like very confusing. All right, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, and thank you for everyone who has subscribed. Um, and my next video is going to be my sinking fund cash stuffing. Um, I'll I might actually just record that right now as well. Um, just to finish it up. And I will see you guys in that video. Bye.